The Lions' next game was away to Derby County. The Rams were struggling to find any sort of form at the baseball ground, and Millwall were determined to take full advantage. It really is a mystery why Derby County can't find any form here on their own ground, especially as they're doing so well away from the baseball ground. Ten million pounds Arthur Cox has spent on rebuilding this side as well, but now they have a chance in midfield. Pembridge, and he's a good, strong runner. Mark Pembridge trying to see Derby up, and he might still get in here. Pembridge has a chance now and takes that chance. That's a good finish from Mark Pembridge. He'd done all the work himself. And then from this little ricochet here, the ball coming back to him from Roberts. He goes on into the Millwall penalty area, and the left foot is sweet enough. Free kick taken uh, by Roberts and then Cooper. Millwall have looked confident when they've been on the ball and they do look confident again now. Andy May, that's a good ball from him. Morley and Jamie Morley gets the equaliser for Millwall and that's his fourth goal in five games. The boy who's come as part of the Chris Armstrong deal from Crystal Palace took no time at all to rifle that one in. One one it is then, and uh, what a good time that was for the equaliser from Morley. 17 minutes into the second half. Here's Gabbiadini for Derby County, however. Tommy Johnson now can't get past Cooper, and Millwall's break could be on. Here's John Byrne. They're almost ganging up down the left. Doors slipping the ball back in field for Barber. Nice little interplay between the two of them. And it's swung across the face of the Derby area. Oh, that's a tremendous strike. What a good goal from Alex Ray. Two goals in two minutes here for Millwall have completely changed the complexion of this match. And that's a tremendous volley. 